everyone, my name is Grace and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is <laughs> A Hairy Tail Samson. Let's read. Again, God's people disobeyed him. So God let the Philistines rule over them for forty years. Then he chose a man named Samson to set them free. So So God's people was ruled over by Palestines. And Palestines were behaving back to the Israel. So God has sent a chosen man, a man named Samson to set them free. An angel promised Samson's mother that she would have a son. Samson would have to make three promises to God. Never drink wine, never touch dead things, and never cut his hair. So, an angel has gone to Samson's mother and said, but you will have and never drink that Samson should never drink wine, never touch his, touch the back that things and cut his hair. Never cut his hair. If they don't cut our hair like it will be very long, so I think it is the hairy tail. Never drink wine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Number two, never touch the dead things. Number three, never cut his hair. But there's three things. God made Samson very strong. He killed a lion and bees made honey in its body. Samson touched the dead lion, breaking one of his promises to God. He even ate the honey. The goddess made Samson very strong. So he killed the lion with his hand suddenly, with no like no sword or something. And that goddess promised. And he have touched the dead lion. He have break one of his promise for, to God. And he even ate the honey. Oh, did you see that? The what the ground was coming dark. Question: Samson has promised God that he would never drink wine, cut his hair, or touch dead things. True. Also, there is a Bible gem. Samson fell in love with the woman named Delilah. The Palestines promised her a lots of money to discover why Samson was so strong. She asked him again and again. So Samson fell in love with Darla, like and Darla was the Palestines. 
and the Palestinians were promising her that if you tell me why Samsung is so strong, then I will give you a lot of money. <laughs> like you can see the Palestinians there. Finally, Samson taught their a letter this secret. If my hair is cut, my strength will go. So while he slept, Sherla called from for a man to cut off his hair. Samson's strength left them. Left them. So what like, Samson didn't tell Darla that like Darla was keep asking and Samson like has told her that her strengths mm -hmm. were coming from his hair. So like Darla has know that and now like he was she's telling the Palestines. <laughs> When the Palestines arrived, they captured them easily. They blended them, blended him. <laughs> then they put his, put him in the prison, and set him to work, dragging a heavy grinding stone. Stone. So like Palestines has captured him very easily because now his strength was gone. Find the Bible. And the question Who convinced Samson to tell a secret and disobey God by having his cut hair? Number one, Darla, right? Slowly, Samson's hair grew back. The Palestines brought Samson into their temple to them, their false, false god Gagon. For defeating him, Samson asked God to make him strong one last time. So Samson's hair grew and they were taking Samson. And Samson was praying to God that like, please make me powerful one more one last time. Samson stood between the pillars and pushed on them. The temple fell down, killing all the Palestines and Samson with them. Samson didn't keep his promise, but God kept his. So now Samson has pushed the pillars and the temple has and all people died. Question, God made Samson strong again so that his people would be free from the Palestines. True. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy the next time? I'll read another good story. Then see you next time. Bye.